Hello everybody and welcome to Infantry Outdoors. Yours truly, your favorite disabled outdoorsman. I'm DJ Infantry back at it again. Today bringing you a very special episode. We are in North Broward today at Kate and R Bait and Tackle. But let me kick off the show as I always do, reminding you who we are sponsored by, the folks that get us here, and the reasons we're doing what we're doing. Today's episode is sponsored by Real Time Bait. Check them out today, guys. Realtimebait.com. Lures, plastics, apparel, all kinds of great things. You can get jerk baits, crank baits, soft plastics, and today's episode is gonna be all about real time bait as well. We're out with them today. Lady B with the National Motor Club, make sure that if you're driving, you're driving with the longest privately owned motor club in the nation. Get yourself that coverage that you and your family need when you're out on the highways and byways. Call Lady B today, and remember that if you sign up using promo code INFANTRY, you get yourself a free vacation. Silver Connections Group, if you want to get your business's Google ranking boosted, increase your social media standings, or even get yourself a brand new website, Silver Connections Group is the way to go. Check them out today at silverconnectionsmobile.com. Also, Grant Herbal Products. Hey guys, we all want to live that healthy life. Remember that your health is your wealth. Invest healthy with Grant Herbal Products. Check them out today at grantherbalproducts.com and we'll be starting to feature a new herbal product each episode here on Infantry Outdoors. So here's what's going on guys. Special thanks to the sponsors. Remember that if you want to become a sponsor of this program, write to us at infantryoutdoors at yahoo.com or you can become a Patreon. Go to patreon.com forward slash infantryoutdoors or you can make a donation via PayPal. Go to paypal.me forward slash infantryoutdoors. Now all of our Patreons and our donations will be recognized in all of our upcoming episodes. So thank you from the bottom of our heart to all of our sponsors, Patreons, and viewers like you that make this program happen. So here's what's going on today, guys. Like I said, today we're at k and Bait and Tackle in North Lauderdale. We got the RTB Junior Squad, the Real Time Bait Junior Squad, on set, on scene, and gonna take them out, have some fun, and let the kids do what they do. So today, I'm gonna make my show all about my real time kids. As you guys know, I'm a big advocate of getting children and people with disabilities outdoors, off the tablets, off the phone, and try these awesome activities that are out here. Today, we're gonna do just that. I've got a group of kids, the RTB Junior Squad, sponsored by Real Time Bait. This is why I love this company, guys. Family owned and operated and family dedicated. Check them out today. Today we're gonna to be out with them. We've also got Fishing Princess Kaya and a few other surprises for you. So today we're gonna to make it all about the RTB Junior Squad here at K&R Bait and Tackle. We're doing the Broward County Takeover and you guys are coming with us. So let's kick things off and let's start by meeting the RTB Junior Squad. RTB Junior Squad! My name is Jack, I'm 11. With the RTB Junior Squad, uh, the favorite part I like about fishing is where I, when I catch big fish, and um, my favorite fish is um, snook. Hi, my name is Peyton. I am 12 years old. Um, I'm in the RTB Junior Squad, and one reason I like to fish, um, I was three, I think, and my dad took me out to bluegill fish, and I just got into it, so. I guess that's how I really learned how to fish. And my favorite fish to catch is probably a cobia. Hi, my name's Connor, I'm 10 years old. I'm in the RTB Junior Squad. Mostly I like fishing because it's just being out there. And then I just like to fish, and my favorite fish mostly is snook. I like to catch snook. That's what I mostly like about fishing. Hi, my name is Rylan. I'm 11 years old, and I'm in the RTB Junior Squad. My, and I love fishing because it gets me out of the house and stop playing video games. And my favorite fish to catch is a snook. Hi, my name is Caleb. I'm 13 years old. I'm in the RTB Junior Squad. Uh, I love fishing just to be in outdoors, and my favorite fish is snook. Hi, my name is Nelson. I'm 10 years old. I'm with the RTB Junior Squad, and I love fishing because being outdoors. And my favorite fish to catch is peacock bass. Hi, I'm Ryan. I'm 10 years old. I'm with the RTB Junior Squad. I love fishing because I, I love being outdoors, and I love catching kingfish. Hi, my name is Kaya, and I am seven years old. I'm in the RTB Junior Squad, and I, I love the outdoors because it's just really, really fun. And my favorite fish to catch is snakehead. Hi, I'm Isabella. I'm 12 years old. I am a part of the RTB Junior Squad. I love to be outside, and my favorite fish to catch is bass. Hi, my name is Brandon. I'm eight years old. I'm with the RTB Squad. I like most about fishing is learning different techniques. My favorite fish is snakehead. 
My name is Dominic. I'm 10 years old. I'm with the RTB Junior Squad. What I like the most about fishing is catching fish, and my favorite fish are the best. Hey guys, I'm here with the man himself, the head of RTB Real Time Baits, and the reason that we are working together for all this time, and you hear me talk about them on every single program. This is Nelson, the president, the owner and operator of Real Time Baits. It's again a family owned and operated business. He's the one putting this whole kids thing together, the RTB Junior Squad. Nelson, what inspired you to do all of this? You know what inspired me is the kids. You know, just seeing the kids have a good time, getting out of the house, not stuck on a video game, enjoying the outdoors, enjoying time with their family and their friends. That's what's inspired me to get the kids out of here to do this. And not just this, guys. RTB itself was inspired by his kid. And that's why I constantly tell you guys when we work with businesses here on this program, they're people that we use, we products we use, people we see on a day-to-day -day basis, family-owned and operated businesses because, well, that's what we are here on the program as well. My whole videography business is run by myself and my family, and I pride myself to bring people like this to take the time to make a business for your son. Yeah, awesome. absolutely. And then to turn around and give back to the community on top of it. So today we're in Broward County. We are. And we want to thank K&R Bait and Tackle. Yes. If you guys are ever in the north Fort Lauderdale area near Commercial yeah. Boulevard, they'll hook you up, come on in and let them know the Real Time Squad, Infantry Outdoors, and YouTube sent you guys here oh, yeah. so they know that we, you know, did our job. But if you're ever in this area, they'll hook you up. They got great baits. I'll take you on a little tour through the store here in just a few minutes. Um, and anything you want to say about KNR Big Tackle? You know what? KNR has a uh been really good to us. They're they're going to be carrying some of our products, and uh, you know we both wanted to return the favor and show some support with our kids, and, and just bring some families and, and you know just bring kids around. So that's what we're about: family owned and operated. And we're going to link KNR down below for you guys, so that even if you are worldwide and you want to check them out, I'll put all their information in the link below. So today we're going to go fishing. We're going to target. What are we going to target today? There's so much in Broward County that I'm so, kind, of, kind of interesting to see what you want to target. So majority of us are from. Um, the Port St. Lucie area, uh, but we came down here because we wanted to target some peacock bass and some snakeheads. A lot of the kids haven't had a chance to get on any of those, so we're hoping to get on a few of those. And from what I understand, grown ups haven't gotten on those yet. <laughs> Shh. Uh, we won't tell you which one yet. We're also going to get on some iguanas. Uh, we've got some special guests that have. Uh, taking time out of their day to come and join us and have a good time with us. And, now know. for my folks from the islands, relax. I don't know if we're putting them on the grill or not. <laughs> but we may, I, I can't tell you, this is YouTube. Catching cooks happen all the time. There you go. Um, but yeah, we got a lot of things going on and it's today, like I said, I'm dedicating my whole episode to the kids of RTB, Nelson and his company. They do a fantastic job. And remember that if you guys are a business owner and you want to reach out to us and do things like this with us, infantryoutdoors at yahoo.com or you can hit us in the link. You can hit us in the description. You can social media us on any of our platforms, Infantry Outdoors. You can even reach out to RTB themselves at realtimebait.com. And remember guys, you hooked up with a promo code, RTB-trial, and you get a special promo just for checking them out. So we're gonna get in. I'm gonna let you guys check out the Bait and Tackle store, grab our gear, we gotta get out and get fishing. So stay tuned, give the video a thumbs up, make sure you comment to the kids because all of these kids are on YouTube, they're gonna be watching, make their day an extra special one by dropping them a special comment. So let's get after it guys. Let's do it. Those are the first things that are on, on every boat I go on with kids. Bait hooks and bobbles. Say hi, Kaya. Hi. What's going on, Kaya? Good. What are you up to? Um, I'm just filming with a camera. Give Infantry Outdoors a big, giant thumbs up. On a boy on the scene, look at these guys. Dude, it's two red air sliders, bro. It was under the rock. Oh, he's got it! Oh, wow. It's really cool. And these are all over the place down there. You'll find these in your pond. You'll find these in your fridge. You'll find these in your, your spillways. You found these where? Under the rock. Under the rock. 
It wasn't even hard to find it, right? No, bro. South Florida is full life. Let's go! Brandon! I got a bat! Hey! Don't just get my line, bro! Shoot, something big. Yo, so where'd you get that huge. turtle? Oh, he just caught these turtles with the rocks. Hey! Brandon, come here. Yeah, buddy. I had to get the other fish, too. All right. Okay guys, so we're moving locations, we're moving and grooving, doing the pond hopping thing. A couple fish on the board today. Kids are having a good time and that's what this is all about. Remember to check out Real Time Bait. They're the one putting on this event today. And check out all of my fellow YouTubers that are out here today. You've got Iguana Man, Iguana Boy. You've got so many people out here showing the love for the kids and that's what this is all about. So remember to give the video a big thumbs up, smash it, double thumbs up. If you can give 10 thumbs up, do it. And drop comments for the kids. They're out here doing a good job, having a good time and representing real-time bait in the proper way. Proper sportsmanship, proper etiquette, and just having a good time. So we're gonna keep moving and grooving. I'm gonna get interviews with some of the other YouTubers throughout the day. Hope you guys are enjoying this, because we are. We're having a good time. We're out here with a whole gang of kids doing what we love to do. And that's what this is all about. So if you aren't subscribed by now, remember to hit that button, ring that bell, be notified every time we put out a video. So we're gonna go back to hooking some lips over here. They got three peacock, large mouth, uh, iguanas, turtles, we got it all going on right here, all on the side of the road, so stay tuned. All right, you guys, so we are out here, and as you guys can see, it's all this really fun madness is unfolding. We got kids from all over the world out here catching iguanas, catching fish. We even had the iguana boy catch a turtle, guys. So it just goes to show you when you go fishing, you have to expect the unexpected. You never know what's going to go down. But I want to give a huge shout out to Real Time Bait for inviting me, my crew, my family out here. And, you know, it's just a blessed day to be out here spend time with all these kids, get them on some fish, get them on some iguanas, and this is what it's all about. Get them on some fish, get them on some iguanas, and just have some fun. That's what life's all about. If you guys want, you guys can go ahead, check out the Iguana Man YouTube channel. Just type in Iguana Man on YouTube. My channel should pop up. You guys can go ahead, check it out. Also, the link will be in the description if you guys want to see some more funny, cool iguana activity. The channel has everything. Baby iguanas, big iguanas. Blue iguanas, green iguanas, red iguanas. So you guys just gotta have to check it out. What is going on, you guys? Welcome back to another crazy adventure. I'm Peacock Bash. I'm Shirley's Dylan. And today we're out here on the banks of South Florida, fishing for pretty much anything that's gonna bite. We have iguanas, we got turtles, we got spotty. Oh, I wasn't supposed to say that. Oops. Oops. Spoiler alert. <laughs> Anyways, we got iguanas, turtles, we got a spiny tail. We're gonna go to the end of this canal and we're gonna have some more iguanas in the pen. Guys, stay tuned. We're gonna show you all the ways to catch iguanas, ways to fish, ways to get better at fishing, and have fun, you know, while you're doing it. Make sure to check out our channel, there's a link below. Hey guys, so we're down here in the uh, North Lauderdale area in Tamarack. Kids are having a blast, we're having a good time. We got all of our new friends and special guests that came to support the group. Um, we got Peacock Bash, Shirtless Dylan. It's just Ralph Fishing. There you go. And these boys working with the kids. Now we're gonna go do some iguanas and uh, keep on fishing for the rest of the day. Let's go. Let's Peter. do it. <laughs> Alright guys, so very common thing to see here in Florida, especially down here in South Florida, are these iguanas. Now I have him pinned pretty good. This is a good sized iguana, uh, probably about four or five years old. They are herbivores, sometimes they're omnivorous, which means they eat both meat and plants. But if you look around South Florida and you see the beautiful hibiscus flower, that's like candy to these lizards. This guy is pretty big, he could really mess me up. Uh, my brother here, he snagged him up. You got some more you want to talk about this big boy? Oh. I mean, this is a big yes. iguana, boy. Oh my god, so. oh my god. one of y'all cast that one, cast that one. All right, we're, we're, we're in iguana heaven right now. So, 
as you guys know in South Florida, as you guys know in South Florida, they actually don't want these things around because they're everywhere, especially in the spot that we're in right now, they're flooded like roaches everywhere. Why do they want these iguanas eradicated? They want them eradi eradicated because they destroy properties, they're breeding like crazy, they don't have enough natural predators to keep the numbers controlled, and if anybody out there watching this video knows that you know they have back iguanas in their backyard and there's a lot of them, you know that there's a lot of feces. If you have a pool, jacuzzi, your jacuzzi will be brown two, two days later. If you have fruits in your backyards, papaya, mango trees, things Gardens, like that, these guys will eat your garden, they will destroy your yard, they will kill your crop, essentially. So that is where these guys come into a, to, oh, sorry. come into play as being a pro. We got stuff all over the place. But this, I wanted to show you guys, this is a very large green iguana. Um, these are fresh water, these you'll find in your lakes, your, I think he's peeing on me. Uh, <laughs> Your lakes, your ponds, your rivers on the side of the road. Now in Florida, we also have the marine iguana, which you'll find more commonly close to the coast, near the sea walls and things like that, which they're more of a grayish color than the green that you see here. Now some of these, did you also, did you also know we have spiny tailed iguanas down That we do too. I didn't touch on that because I know you have a surprise coming. Okay. Ah, okay. spoiler No. <laughs> But yeah, we've got a lot of different kinds of iguanas. And that's the cool thing about living in South Florida, is not just catching these. We've got, as you guys have seen on the news, the pythons, we've got the tegus, we've got these, we've got Cuban anoles, chameleons, chameleons geckos, uh, skinks. We have so many things. I, I try to tell people that I think Florida is kind of like Australia. It's the place people put everything they don't want. It is and the we home. have it all yes. here. Yes. We have it all. Florida is the home for all invasive species to thrive, whether they're plants, animals, Anything, anything invasive can survive down here. Remember, we don't get winter. Right, no cold so, fronts. No cold fronts. And no even, our, even, even our small cold fronts, they'll do a number on the iguana population. But like I said, these are everywhere, and it's sad to say, but they're not going anywhere. Yep, they have no predators. And the opportunity for show you guys this, I haven't held an iguana this big in many, 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 many years. But I mean, you can just head to tail to me. He's almost as big as I am. Yeah, man. And if this thing were to hit me with its tail, oh, you it would be like getting hit with a bullwhip. It would break your skin wide open, leave a nasty mark. But all in all, these are some of the coolest animals we have in South Florida. Um, I know a lot of my viewers in the Caribbean islands, this is lunch or dinner. This is a good sized dinner. And maybe me and Iguana Man, we're gonna get together and, and Peacock Bash, we, we think we're gonna do a little catch we'll make it happen, you know what I'm days, saying? No, don't wanna spoil it for you guys, but you know, we'll make it happen. We're gonna make some stuff happen. But in a great opportunity for this, for me, hey look, a blind guy catching an Iguana. Did you ever think you see it? It happens on YouTube. This man hooked it up. So make sure you check out his channel and all the other YouTube groups that are out here today working with the Real Time Bait Squad. His head's stuck! And there's your iguana. What an amazing day we're having out here, guys, with all the amazing animals we're finding right here in South Florida. We're not looking hard, we're just finding it. And what is this? So, man, this right here is a Mexican spiny tail iguana. Yup, there's the green iguana, the black spiny tail, and the Mexican spiny tail. As you guys can see, this lizard right here looks very similar to like a Komodo dragon or something not typical to what you hear when you think of an iguana. It's a very intelligent animal right here. Uh, these things would eat insects, uh, they'll eat small mammals like little rats. Also, they eat grass too, so they eat everything. Um, just like the green iguana, this is another invasive species that we have in South Florida. And as you guys can see, absolute, absolute beauty. Yeah, you gotta turn them around so they can see what I'm seeing. You guys gotta see this here, turn them completely around. Look at the colors on this thing. Look at the back, I'm gonna keep my hand here just for safety's sake. Look at the colors on this. And as we saw the iguana earlier, the one that I was holding, the bigger one, was greener, it was more vibrant. This one, not so much. This was more of a dull color, but really cool. Different iguana species. This is one of many that we have here in Florida. So we have the marine iguanas, we have the green iguanas, and we have the spiny tailed iguanas. Check out its tail, though. Look, this is. Look at this tail. Look at this tail, real quick. Look at that. Iguana boy, check out the spikes of this tail. Isn't that insane? 
Oh, that's a monster. <laughs> that is how, why it got, down here. That's, that's why it's got its name right there, the spiny tip. Hey, let me tell you something. If you ever get hit, these guys work with iguanas regularly, so they'll back me up. If you get hit with these tails, it's like getting cracked with a bull. Oh, oh yeah. Any iguana. Yeah. Now, just imagine no. these things right here. Oh, if you go backwards. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So always, if you're in South Florida or anywhere and you have any type of animal like this, always leave it best to the professionals, always leave it best to the experts to handle them. Um, best to look at afar, you know, it's like the old saying about the ugly girlfriend, good from afar, but far from good. That's kind of how these wild animals are. So only handle them with trained professionals, or if you are a trained professional yourself, not somebody to watch the YouTube video. Because I can guarantee you're gonna come back to me, him, any iguana boy and go, I got bit. Yeah, well, why'd you get bit? Go watch it on YouTube. Yeah, and, and the bite from this iguana is very severe, guys. That's it, gonna hurt. It's not like your typical green iguana. These actually have one of the strongest bites of any of the lizards over here in South Florida, guys. I wish he would. Actually, she's really calm right now, but uh, she was to open her mouth. Off, you guys would see. She looks like a raptor. When you point her at me, she really does look like a raptor. Whoa! Oh! to see oh! insane uh, rows of teeth in her mouth. Because I'm gonna give you a backdrop so the camera can focus. I hope the camera's focusing. Yeah, you wanna bite me, I know, and I don't, I'm not doing it, it's not me. Hey, these animals are off the chain, guys. But again, best view from afar. Don't try this at home. Um, only do the experienced professionals like ooh, the iguana fellas here. Ooh, team iguana. What a beauty, guys. What a really beauty. Really cool. Another South Florida awesome animal brought to you here on YouTube. Hope you guys are enjoying it. And that's what this day has really been all about, kids. Showing them animals, trying to catch fish, just being out, having a good time. Family unit, doing what we do. So stay tuned. We got more in store. Infantry Outdoors is sponsored in part by RealTimeBait.com 100% customizable soft plastics made your way. Shop today at RealTimeBait.com Lady B with the National Motor Club Drive protected, drive with the Motor Club. Grant Herbal Products. Live a healthy life Shop GrantHerbalProducts.com Silver Connections Group Improve your social media, get better Google rankings, or start your new website at silverconnectionsmobile.com and buy donations from viewers like you. Guys, what a great day we've had with the RTB Junior Squad and the head, the guy, the reason I'm here, the whole reason Real Time Bait is on this program is this gentleman right here. I call him the president. He is the president of Real Time Bait and realtimebait.com. It's Nelson. Nelson, how was the day today, bro? It was amazing. Amazing. Now, all of these kids, did you think all these people were going to show up? No. No. Your dad and I were on the phone the other day. We were even wondering how many kids we'd really have. And if somebody wanted to have the real-time squad or have you guys come out to their location and hang out with them, how can they do that? Uh, they're going to have to link up with us at Real Time Bay. And you guys are just going to have to get permission to pretty much do it. Well, we can do all of that through realtimebait.com. You can also follow them on Instagram at Realtime RTB, right? Yeah. RTB on Instagram. You can reach me on here in Infantry Outdoors. I'll get you contacted. Um, anywhere in the multiple county areas that we're here in South Florida, the real time kids will come out, they'll hang out, they'll fish. And if you guys aren't inspired by these little guys, yeah, we didn't catch a lot today, but we had fun, right? Yeah. Yeah, we had a good time between the iguanas, between the turtles, between the fishing and the fun and the camaraderie. And my buddy Nelson, I get to hang out with him because they live up north for me, so it's not often I get to hang out with you guys. Yeah. So it's always good to get together. It's like a family get, get together with all of us. And that's what today and this has been all about. About. Now, you're a big man, you're a superstar yourself, right? Yeah. What is your handle on Instagram? It's the underscore real underscore showtime. There you go, guys. The underscore real underscore. I'm going to put it right down here. Of course, my buddy Nelson, Real Time Bay, and all of the celebrities and everybody that are out here today will be linked below. Right? We got a link them below. Link below. Link below. That's right. And what else is linked below? The way that you can find Nelson and the family. Realtimebait.com. Go over there, check them out. And Nelson, you got even hooking up with a promo code, bro. You know yep. that? I got a promo code for the viewers. We get to give them a discount. 
RTB trial. That'll get you 10% off your first order just for checking us out, just for becoming a part of the Real Time Bay family. And remember, 100% customizable soft plastics. What else we got? Jerk Hard baits. baits. Hard baits. Hard baits. Jerk baits. Uh... Apparel. Like you see yeah. the shirts wear what? Now you guys can't have the Junior Squad shirts. That's exclusive to the squad. But you can get fine RTB apparel at realtimebait.com, right? Yep. So we got lures, we've got cheeks, we've got everything you could possibly need for a day out on the water with your kids or by yourself. Check us out at where? Realtimebait.com. Yeah. You see, I had the opportunity to get you in front of the president. And now I have the vice president of Real Time Bait. <laughs> because you know, it's funny, I was telling the listeners, we met through your son. You did. And ever since we met, I've been calling him the president of Real Time Bait. Matter of fact, I'm going to link right here the video we met so you guys can check it out. It was awesome. He walked me through the baits like he was second to none, a professional salesman, like he just did to see with the jig. It's the jig with the swim, with the rib shad. All of these are available. Bro, what an awesome one. I gotta tell you, I'm super excited. Thank you for helping us and joining in with us. Um, it was just a fabulous day. The kids were able to get out. Some caught fish, some didn't. But you know what? That's what fishing is all about. That's um, why it's fishing and not catching. Exactly. You know, we, we had a blast. Uh, our goal today was to get a hold of the kids, get them together, get the families together. You can't really see it, but we've got all our family over here. And it's all about getting out and enjoying each other's company. Um, you know, it's not just about the fishing. It's about camaraderie amongst teammates, you know, your, your community, things of that nature. It, it's been a great day. Listen, some caught fish, some caught iguanas, some caught, you know, turtles. I mean, it's, it's been a great day. I mean, Amazing I, what I, you I, find I, in South Florida. I had a ton I mean, of fun. <laughs> um, Every I, day is an adventure down here. Oh yeah, I mean, I, I caught a little bass, probably about this big, but you know what, most of all, I got the joy of watching all the kids have a good time today and uh, having all the parents hang out with us, have lunch, tell us how grateful they are that the kids are having a good time today. That's what Real Time Bait's all about. Um, and, and I'm just thankful that we were all able to get together and, and do this again. I think you've done a bang up job. Thank you. I can't believe we have all these kids here. There's got to be at least 20 kids today. You, you know, it, it's, I, I just can't. I'm so overwhelmed with the joy of seeing all the kids and all the parents together. Um, it's more than just fishing, folks. It really it's, it's about getting the kids out, networking, it, meeting networking, new people, enjoying their company. You know, them enjoying you know the outdoors. Like it's just been such a fabulous day, and uh, I'm very grateful and thankful that we were able to participate together as a team, as a squad. You know, uh, it's the RTB Junior Squad, but at the end of the day, we're just a big squad because the parents are involved. And the parents drove, you know, some yep. of the parents drove from Port St. Lucie down here to, you know, the Fort Lauderdale, Davie area. So it, it's a big thank you to everyone. And everyone, uh, as far as the YouTubers like Peacock Bass, Shirtless Dylan, you know, Fishing Person Kaya was with us. Um, you know, we, we had Real Deal Adventures out here. We've got DJ Infantry, Infantry Outdoors with us. Like, there's just a lot of people involved in. Thank you to everyone that really, really took their time to help us and, and, and make this happen for the kids. Because at the end of the day, that's what it's always been about. Uh, Real Time Base has been about the kids and, and, and getting us to be able to do things like this. And we're finally at that you know, portion of, of, of time now that we can get the kids to enjoy themselves and we're able to help them do that. And right here, guys, you can see when you buy our product, you see where it goes. It goes right back into the product and the yep. kids and the development and things like that. So being able to put this firsthand is one of the things I like. This is why I deal with sponsors like Nelson and the way that I deal with them. I, I want to bring you everything. I want to show you how we make the baits. Not the secret ones, but the ones that you everyday bait you guys can see. Uh, we want to show you what the company is about. And you guys see it here. 20 kids all day long fishing, drinks, snacks. We caught fish, we caught turtles, we've had YouTubers come out. And again, not many companies are about that. So check them out today, realtimebait.com. He's even hooking you guys up with a promo code RTB-TRIAL. Get you 10% off your first order just for trying this out. And again, you see where it's gonna go right back into. The RTB Junior Squad, events, and things that are coming up, which we're gonna be bringing you here as well. So, my brother, for the last year and a half, thank you for being a sponsor. Thank you, sir. We had a great time. I mean, 
he helped out big time. His baits killed in the King of the Glades. I think I caught most of my fish on, on their rib shack. Good to hear. Good to hear. Uh, we've got King of the Glades 2020. I think it's 2020 already, right? Yeah. Oh, see, it's been a long day in the sun. 2020 is coming up. So if you guys want to get on board with Nelson and Real Time Bait, you want to become a sponsor for the 2020 season, we kick off in January. Write to us below. Or again, if you want to have Real Time Bait Junior Squad or anything Real Time related or any of the sponsors related, write to us at infantryoutdoors at yahoo.com. But guys, day's done, man. We had a time it's tired. It. It's Beautiful. a long one. I'm gonna Beautiful actually day. go get off camera. I'm gonna have a nice cool drink and I'm gonna relax for five minutes because I've been running all day. Guys, thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. Thank you to all the sponsors, Real Time Bait, Silver Connections Group, um, Grant Herbal Products, and of course, Lady View at the National Motor Club. Guys, hope this and all of our adventures inspires you to get outdoors. We gonna catch you next time. See ya. Legends never die